You, you are, are grounded. grounded. You, you are, are grounded. grounded. Good morning class, today we will do an algebra test, but you all will pair up because this algebra test is over 30 pages long. Okay, so the pairs will be, on my list, Paige and Harry Strack. Wow, I can't believe this. This is our first time partnering up. Yeah, I know right? I asked my girlfriend, and she said it was okay. So we're only partnering up, you and me. Oh and Nathan. You will not be partnered up with any of your troublemaker friends because 1. You will cheat on the test, and 2. You will make excuses to ditch my class. So, I decided to let you work on your own. What? No, that's so not fair. Well, that sucks to be you. Anyway, I will pass out the worksheets right now. Now, everyone go to the back to do your work. Huh, what is, what is x, x plus 2 squared, squared equals equal to 4x? 4 x? <laughs> hey Nathan, wake up. You cannot be asleep during the assignment. Yeah, and besides, it's not nap time. Now wake up or I will tell the teacher. No way. Algebra is too f***ing hard. How about Congress can ban it? Because 1. It's complicating, 2. It takes too long for me to think, and 3. It's stupid and it's excess. Well how about you start studying more? That's right. Nathan, you shouldn't be sleeping in class. And Harry is right, you should be paying attention and studying if you wanna pass algebra. But no. You decide to just goof off and not do anything. Now get back to work or you will have detention. Alright class, now that's out of the way, while I grade your papers. You can go take a break. So, go take your 15 minute break. Thank God we are out of that hellhole of a classroom. Dude, can you just shut up about the classroom already? It's getting very annoying right now. No. I can talk about the classroom if I'm motherfucking wild because being in that class is complete fuck torture unlike for you both. Feel like I have been held captive or hostage, and that's why I hate school. Keep lecturing me, why don't you? Well, she is right, you know. You need to just get over it. Oh, stay out of this, Harry. This doesn't even concern your ass. Don't talk to Harry like that, or we will have this fight out here. Yeah, right. Ha 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 Like you and your girlfriend are gonna do anything. Now come on. Show me how tough you are. Oh wait, never mind because you aren't trained too well. <laughs> oh, you have asked for it. Oh, dang. Paige really knocked Nathan out. Man, that ought to hurt. Nathan, get up, get up. Strike her back. Oh yeah, a cat fight, eh? Let's go. Fight, 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 Time to taste a huge rocker. Whoa, Paige, why would you do that? He deserved it. 
This is Sadiq X. Oh no, what is that noise? Did he really survive that? Right. Well, I'm going to deflate you and I will kill you. So get ready. Not if I deflate you first. Hey, you two, stop fighting right now. I said, stop fighting right now. Or else. I'm going to finish this. You two need to stop fighting. What is the meaning of that? He she started, started it. Well, one of you started it, and I am going to find out. Now, I will beat you both up to the pull office, so get ready. Wow, that was a very intense fight. Who knew you can just go buff and lift a ton of lockers? Well, let's go back to class before we get caught and get sent to detention. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. What was the noise? Here I can say, why they have Nathan and Paige here, and why they beaten up. What was going on out there? Did they get in a fight or something? Well sir, they did in fact, get into a fight, and worse, the one in the pink shirt and blue sleeves, grew buff and carried a ton of lockers and crushed her brother with them. You know what, I'm just going to call the doctor, because of what I just heard from you. Fine by me. Is this a bad time? Ah, uh, no. You're welcome in here. Oh, okay. Anyways, I have something for the both of you. What, what is, is it? it? Paige, for you, I give you a get well soon gift. Thanks. I am going to open it and see what's inside. Wow. I got a get well soon card. Candy cape. And a no bake cookie. But wait. Hang on. Doctor. What is it? I have a question for you. Why aren't there any IV stands in this room? Well, it's because we were too cheap to afford any due to lack of time to open this place. Hopefully we'll be able to afford some someday or we'd all go bankrupt and shut down. What? No IV stands. But that can't be. I'm afraid, it can. So, continue with what you were about to do. Goodbye. Okay, um, I guess. Well, I'm going to beat when my car says, get well soon. Stay out of trouble. Chili, thanks for the gift. You're welcome. Now I have to give a gift to your brother. Well, I guess I have no choice to give this to you. Here, take it. Troublemakers these days. Well, I will just open my get well soon gift anyway. What? I got a book. How unfair. Oh, just read the book already? No. Reading is for losers and nerds. Nathan, Paige, your mother is here. Let's go home right now. But first, get changed into your normal clothes before we leave. You are in some deep trouble. But Dad, I don't want Have a good day. Changed. You no too, and I will try to control like my kids the normal way. They had a fight in the hallway. Stop okay, and Bob stay Bob out of trouble. Okay, we will. What? He started it. What? You punched me first. That's enough. Anyway, let's go home now. You're both are still in deep trouble. Nathan and Paige, I am very disappointed in you two. Starting fight in the school hallway? How unforgivable. Nathan, you're grounded for a year, and Paige, you're grounded for a day. Go to your rooms now and think about what you have done.